Welcome back to another Fill a Minute, where we talk about filaments for a few minutes each week and hopefully get you interested in trying out some new stuff. This week though, it's not completely new. You've probably used this already, but I have a fun use case for something that I wanna highlight because I made a mistake and printed something in the wrong material before even learning about the grand scheme of 3D printing and materials and how you're supposed to use what. If you're not familiar with the series, it's me trying to you know, get familiar with filaments, provide value to you guys in a short, condensed way. And also, uh, Prusa challenged me and told me if I can get a certain number of views on 3D printing uh, videos, then they'll send a core one. And I'm dying to get a core one because I'm dying to use better filaments. A while ago, I printed some recessed lights using PLA. Here's the problem. Uh, they warped because it got too hot. And now I don't have an enclosure because I don't have a core one yet. So without an enclosure, you're limited with the materials that you can kind of use. And so I'm stuck between, you know, the PLAs, the PET Gs, and maybe on a rare occasion under the right circumstances, a PC blend. Technically, Prusa says their PC blend you can use, I think, uh, enclosures recommended, but not mandatory. I need something a little more heat resistant than PLA, uh, something hopefully that isn't gonna just melt under the heat of an LED. They're not super hot, but they're a little hot. Uh, so I came with PET G. And now there's two types of PET G I'm using. One, I have this clear pet G, which I think it's awesome. Um, a few projects that I want to use this for are like diffusion for lights, um, which like a recessed light, but also film lights and things like that. Uh, for the enclosure, I have white pet G. Uh, and this is the, in my opinion, the best upgrade to my system that I've done so far. Originally, I printed it in black PLA and one, Black is notorious for getting hotter uh, because it absorbs all the light. Uh, and white is notorious for staying cooler because it reflects all the light and all the heat out. Um, the reason why this is good isn't just for heat, but for light, because if you're making a light, having it white means just more light will be emitted. Uh, not from the LEDs, but the casing at least won't absorb as much light. It'll put more out into the room, which is awesome. But that's really it. I wanted to showcase some clear pet G, some white pet G. I think it's a really interesting use case for this. Um, and if you like it, please, you know, like, share, subscribe, all that stuff, just because this is a relatively new channel. I'd like it to grow. I'd like you to be a part of it. So uh, any support really helps. If I provide a value, let me know in the comments. If I stink, let me know in the comments. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you next time.